Hello, my dear viewers. Welcome to today's message. Today being Thursday, December 21st, 2023, and this message is for everyone. I do hope those of you who are celebrating today, may you have a wonderful happy birthday and a glorious day. And those of you celebrating anniversaries or any other celebrations, I wish you a glorious day and a beautiful celebration. Best wishes to each and every one of you here, my dear viewers. I wish you the best of the best and a beautiful day. Let us begin to see what are important messages. This message is for the collective, for each and every one of us. And one card has come up. Let's see. It says release and surrender. Release and surrender. What a beautiful card. Let's read. I haven't seen this one. Maybe in a long time or never. It says, we shower you with blessings of our radiant love. We shower you with blessings of our radiant love. Open your arms and release the challenges that you have held tightly gripped within your hands. Release them. Open your hands, arms, and heart to our love and assistance. Not only love, but assistance. And that is beautiful. Great gratitude. This is beautiful. We all need this. All of us. Each and every one of us. In one area of our life or another. Let's see for the um, sacred forest message for everyone. 21st December. And it says flow. The flow of energy is going to be um, leading you the path. And I feel like this energy is going to bring you a lot of healing um, extraordinary heal, heal, healing, sorry, and also love, success and love coming together, partnerships doing well, and a passage of absolute energy, power, and healing, and quick success, mind you, also. So, my dear viewers, let's see, okay, messages for today. I've already shuffled, so I don't know why I shuffled them again. Let's have a look for... Um, Okay, that's it. This one first. I saw this one and I had a feeling about it. I'll take the second one also. This one and that one. That's it. Easy. That was very easy. Okay, here we go. Now let's have a look. What are the messages for today? And we have... We have success. Beautiful success. And last thing I said was here, success. And there it is. Without a doubt, success. Okay. We have the barking dog. The dog barking. It's about advice from a friend. And it's also about the Chinese ear of the dog. It's about loyalty and friendship at the same time. And what the tea leaves say, advice from a friend. Then we have the camel. You're moving. Many are relocating, thinking about moving. And, um, and a gift coming. Uh, gifts coming, people coming to visit also. Now let's look at the, um, the, the leaves. It says persevere and you will overcome problems. Persevere and you'll overcome problems. Okay, that's the camel. And then we've got marriage. Beautiful marriage, wonderful marriage. Agreements, marriage, contracts, all of that. Now let's have a look at four major impacts that will impact the collective for the 21st of December. The truth. Starting with the first one, and we have the devil. Something is being done just too much. It's just too much to the point where you can't handle anymore. You have to heal from this, and you will be healing. Healing is on its way. So, um, and success is on its way. So, something excessive, controlling, maybe too much, someone too much controlling. There's money coming in, extraordinary amounts of money, unexpected large amount of money, foundation changing money, home, residence changing money, coming to you where you are going to be trying to control over and be very um, vigilant when you are getting advice. Always get two, three advice before you take action. The next card shows there is an area where there's a lot of conflict. And this conflict, you are defeated. There's nothing much you can do. Every attempt is failing. And the truth is the one that's biting in the butt. It's causing the conflict and causing you to be feeling defeated. And there's nothing more you can do. Finally, there are choices and opportunities. One opportunity is going to be spectacular. The others could have hidden agendas, misunderstandings, misrepresentations of the truth. But there is one opportunity, and it could be opportunity of the heart. So uh, choose wisely. Use your mind, but use your heart also. If your heart says, no, there's something not right here, uh, do pay attention to it. Okay, very important. Now... Finally, what you don't see coming, leaving a situation maybe that you are defeated in, grieving the loss of and leaving, grieving the loss of something or someone, 
um, someone is going to help you through this loss while you're in the process of it and a new beginning is coming a new beginning that gives you the greatest gift of all the greatest whether it's money extraordinary money or true love either one that gives you marriage so it could be either one I'll just put these two together it could be marriage or it could be wealth either one success is the other one I'll just put success so that you know excess of money success or marriage either one is going to take you to the next level beautiful okay so that's what you don't see coming I think uh oh what did I do success is here marriage is here this is over here that's better okay now let's see three more energies what else you need to know we have the Hierophant we had this yesterday actually the Hierophant is about commitment so some of you are committing and that's why we have marriage commitment and marriage go hand in hand uh, uplifting your and, and you know of course the greatest love of all and marriage and commitment many of you are going through engagements planning marriage planning weddings this is beautiful absolutely gorgeous for everyone who's going through that um, so the Hierophant is the other one and the Hierophant also stands for um, uplifting wisdom paying attention to your higher self and and moving forward in many areas thriving studying further um, more spirituality growth big time wisdom and all that abiding by the rules and regulations there's that movement that I was talking about leaving I said somebody's leaving some of you are leaving some of you are doing the most that they can to be to leave but uh, release and surrender shows to me that you will be leaving a situation that's been overwhelming you too much of you know when I said something being excessive you're leaving so that's great news and finally the last one it shows there is an ending the two of swords did come yesterday in the reading so it shows to me there is a, uh, a situation has reached an impasse there's nothing more you can do just like the five of swords the truth the swords are the truth releasing you the truth is releasing you from something that you are feeling defeated there's nothing more you can do you've done it all there's nothing nothing is in your hands this is something like part of uh, maybe a chapter ending coming to an end what you don't see coming and happening the queen of wands here someone of fire energy is going to be very helpful sagittarius aries leo and another thing that you oh king and then you got the king of uh wands uh fire energy aries sagittarius leo so you got two fire energies that are going to be very supportive and helpful let's have a look at what else you need to know and then i'll clarify some of the cards Two more messages, December 21st. We've got the golden butterflies. One more. And we've got the crown. One more beautiful than the other one. And let's talk about them. Okay. The golden butterflies is about a sudden change. Something suddenly takes place. And then there is so much spending because of this. Whatever it is, it's going to be something so big. Now it could be a marriage proposal and then bang, you've got to start spending, organizing, you know, um, caterers and, and dresses and, 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 and tuxedos and, 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 you know, honeymoon and everything. So all of a sudden, a lot of spending, um, even to the point where you might take a short loan. So that's very interesting. The sudden transformation, sudden change is also about people leaving their jobs for better jobs. There's movement, moving. Remember, relocating is there also. The greatest gift is there. So there might be something incredible being given to you. That could be also another reason for this. The greatest gift of all. Um, for some of you, it could be marriage. Uh, for others, it could be success, that you might be moving to a better place and being more successful. But the sudden change ultimately is bringing you, uh, maybe the sudden change could be also this money. Don't forget this money. And relocating could be another one. So marriage, success, money, relocation, all that is a great possibility. A wonderful possibility. Great things are happening. Wonderful things are happening. So back to where we were and we were here we were here we were here okay now um the next thing i want to talk about is i think we did we talked about that that yeah mm -hmm. 
Yes, I know. Oh, yes, sorry. So the butterflies were, we were talking about the butterflies here yeah, and fun work also with the butterflies. A sudden change and you have more fun in your work. The crown is amazing. It's about wealth, power play, wealth, overcoming all obstacles, uh, managing and progressing, uh, making progress, sorry. Um, and careers being your own boss, owning your own business, taking charge big time but most of all it's about wealth and wealth is all over the place so you've got wealth here you've got success here and you've got the camel and the camel is about presents and gifts from the heavens and the universe so success and come camel and wealth and a sudden either windfall yesterday we had the windfall you've got to watch yesterday or um, a sudden impact of money a large amount of money so all that is possible now now let's go to the next level and see what else you need to know we'll do the butterflies next butterfly spirit to see what else you need to know two messages true we've got the first one rest is very important getting some rest rejuvenating resting and it says health care is changing so you've got to be careful pay attention to your health that needs your attention maybe just very important that you pay attention to your health care and just have a look at your insurance cover see if it it does give you everything you need the truth because for the collective and healing many of you are going through the process of healing uh, forgiving and healing and releasing and purging that's beautiful and then we've got unrequited love where there is no connection anymore you're not attracted enough there isn't enough chemistry there isn't enough to keep something going it's coming to an end and this is why maybe somebody is grieving the loss there isn't enough to keep it happening uh where you are feeling defeated confliction this is where the unrecorded love is taking place it's just not enough there to hold it together and yet there are some of you getting married. So this is the world. And what I love about these readings, they give you the good and the bad. And they give you all, they touch everybody's heart. Now, the truth that we all need to know for the 21st, it says, life is a series of constantly shifting cycles. Now I don't need my glasses with this new phone. It's wonderful. It's not blurry. Um, life is a series of constantly shifting um, cycles when we resist change and that is very important when you resist change we resist the normal flow of life and create unnecessary stress so go with the flow and that's what this is all about go with the flow and don't make life uh, more complicated than already it is and the way to go with the uh, the flow of life is by being flexible being open using your perspective changing your perspective bring a fresh one on if you if you have to go with the flow and you will be surprised where it leads because the flow of life the the mandeering is it the uh, the mandeering pathway is a pathway of absolute happiness coming the light coming into your life so don't be afraid of change and look at that we've got change anyway and there's going to be sudden change to bring on the next maybe you know, i mean i am one of those people um, who doesn't like change that much. I do like change to a certain degree, but not too much of it. So uh, there is release, there is change, there is uh, happiness coming in every way, it looks to me. So uh, when things are not working, you've got to embrace change. Now, oh, I did that. What am I doing? Sorry. <laughs> now, let's go to the next level. And rest is needed, and there is an ending, as you can see. This was the unrequited love. That's what I was looking for. Something that you can't do much about a relationship that just isn't working anymore. So now we go to the devil and see what the devil is for the collective. What is this controlling excessiveness? Okay, it might be connected to families, could be connected to Virgo, people that have Virgo in them or are Virgo. This is a Virgo card. Um... Earth energy, very strong, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This could be connected to family issues. There could be problems. There could be um, controlling situations. Somebody is very controlling, trying to control the situation, and this is causing unhappiness. Someone is soul-searching, reflecting what to do next. I feel like um, some of you could be starting uh, working in teamwork or business, but I do feel like someone is being controlling and there is someone suffering in the process. Uh, you need to know a lot of uh, what's stemming up after this. Somebody is destined to live a happy life and there is a new beginning coming. After a lot of crying, after a lot of sleepless nights, after a lot of stress, 
the nine of swords after all that uh, there is going to be happiness a life of luxury and happiness and a new beginning that brings you abundance so that's what's coming after the devil and there is that relocation again remember i said the two of which is here i'll just take it out there the two of wands relocation moving so you're moving uh, leaving the situation this excessiveness this controlling if you're if you are dealing with someone controlling the the controlling person could be leaving let's have a look at the money the four of pentacles this uh, unexpected money it's helping you take action giving you a new idea a new movement an epiphany or two a lot of understanding and a great victory but you're a new beginning at the same time you're taking action very quickly and you're very excited and the beginning of of prosperity begins and abundance and money and rewards for a job well done applause for a job well done victory and so much money that you can help others so much money is coming from this money that you will be able to help others and the beginning of prosperity and money is all happening coming together a lot of rewards extraordinary okay we'll leave that here now we move on to this situation where you're feeling defeated and why it's not working Let's have a look at this conflict, this severe conflict. It's not your average conflict because it is defeated. No matter what you do, there's no win. And the truth is the painful one. So it's connected to, there it is, here it is. And that's what I love, the synchronicity that the gods are here with me, helping me deliver these messages to you. It is in regard to earth energy. I was right. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn are connected to this. There is someone that's going to be very helpful, maybe supporting you to move to the next level. You are feeling defeated and it is ending. Something is ending big time and and it's destined to end. Something wonderful is coming. You're going to be resting, healing, and then there's a fire energy and the sun will be shining again. Fire energy very strong here. We have got the fire energy. This is the queen of wands twice. Sagittarius mostly. Could be Leo or Aries. Fire energy very strong. Uh, we have fire energy also here with the king so we had the queen and the king of wands someone of fire energy is going to support you big time help you move forward and the sun is going to be shining again giving you all the blessings and all the healing that you need so that is tremendous in regard to this chapter that is so overwhelming and look at that at the end of this the ten of wealth and a great victory awaits you okay uh, the ten of wealth as i'm talking about wealth <clears throat> The Ten of Wealth it did come up three times yesterday. And um, Earth energy very strong. Let's have a look so you can see the reading of yesterday. Now we're uh, very important because the Three of Pentacles, which is wealth and riches, came three times, which was shocking. Let's have a look at the opportunities that are here and misleading and misinterpreting the reality. But one good opportunity. Let's have a look. Justice will prevail and you are going to be um, dealing with someone of earth energy Virgo Taurus Capricorn who is going to be very supportive some of you are dealing with Libra this is a kind of Libra there's going to be justice for you there could be an earth energy Virgo Taurus Capricorn with a Libra uniting uh, in deals together contracts agreements uh, this opportunity is going to be a spectacular one uh, and these two people are going to thrive I also feel uh, there could be air energy here Virgo Taurus Capricorn with Aquarius Gemini Libra again I'll say it and there are uh, you, you need the strength and the courage to be patient. A little bit of patience is needed. And then you are going to be getting some great news and moving forward with this person. And that's, I think, uh, for now, that's about it for today, I think. Although I did want to do one more thing, which is this queen. I want to know about the queen of um, wands. How is that for the, what's going on with the queen of wands for the collective? Oh my God, this person's going to be the person. Oh my God. At a time where you are stressed and, and things are falling apart, this queen is bringing on this for someone of earth energy, bringing on so much money. She, this person could be the cause. It doesn't mean uh, just don't worry about the gender part of this person. This person's going to be the cause of this money coming and helping you reach your goal. Where you are feeling defeated and there's nothing you can do, Big money is coming, and I feel like the cause of this money and this support is going to be someone of fire energy. Pay attention to someone, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. This person is going to be giving you a lot of money or supporting you to reach your goal. Wow, that is amazing. For this to 
come up twice. Maybe this is a sudden change. And where is that crown? I need to see the crown because crown is all about wealth. And then we've got wealth to the highest level with the Six of Pentacles being very powerful. And I feel like this is all connected to someone of fire energy. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Truly, this is magnificent. Wealth to the highest level, unexpected abundance of money, giving you so much power to help others. I feel like you, if it's you, somebody is supporting you. Or if it's you getting the money, you're getting yourself out and helping others who are stuck with you in a situation where you are defeated, where money will play the role and, and release you. Maybe you can move. Finally, you're able to be released and you can move. At a time where you're stressed and things are falling apart and you've got to leave, it is at that time the money is going to be your um, your green card to move forward. It's going to help you move forward and get to exactly where you want to be. I feel this is to do with earth energy, very strong fire energy and air also. So let's have a look at two more messages to see oh, what else we need to know and what the Chinese cookies are going to tell us. It says assert yourself. Assertion is very important, you know, boundaries, setting boundaries and everything. Oh, maybe I don't need the glasses. I'm very happy like this. Oh, wow. Yes. It says go. Go for what you want. The time is ripe for a soulmate. Hmm. A soulmate connection. Birth of a child's also likely. But assert yourself and set boundaries. Very important. Now, the next one says reinventing yourself. A new lease of life. A transformation is taking place. Enjoy a new lease of life. And that's exactly what we got. The butterflies. A new lease of life. Wow. This is amazing. Incredible prepare for that success is coming gifts are coming marriage is there don't forget an abundance as i showed you everything is here for you so release and surrender is telling me that you will be showered with so much happiness marriage love everything you see i'm going to put it all together everything is going to be there marriage is also there and success and actually I'll just put this. An amazing new beginning that brings you prosperity in everything. In money, marriage, relationships, everything. And justice. Justice for all. So even though some things are falling apart and not working, the sudden change that's taking place is going to take you to the next level and you are going to be thriving. Absolutely thriving with where you're going to be ending up. And marriage, those of you who are getting married, planning a wedding, it's just beautiful. Absolutely. What more can be beautiful other than abundance and marriage, planning a wedding together? It's beautiful. All right, my TV viewers, that's the end of your reading. I do hope you enjoyed it. Do let me know what you think. Please support me by subscribing to the channel. I need your support in that way. It doesn't cost a thing. And seeing the videos through till the end. And when you can't, just let them run their course without stopping them. That is the best support you can give me. Other than that, everything is wonderful. I love to hear from you. Read your stories. Always uh, love your comments and give me thumbs up. Wish you abundance of blessings in these happy holidays to everybody that are coming. Be safe. Take care of yourself. And lots of love and light to you and your family. Namaste.